What is up guys, my name is Talha and you are watching Gadgets Sphere. So this is the Pixel Plus UI 4.3 running in the Poco X3 Pro. So in today's video, I'm going to talk about the things which are really good and the things which are not that great. So first of all, the things which are great is this Android 12. So this is of course the latest version of Android and yeah, it's just really awesome and I just like it. Um, there you go. Boom. Android 12. So what are the things which are great? First of all, the app open animations are just amazing. Like opening messages, opening Play Store, opening photos, opening Chrome. Everything is really nice and smooth and fluid. So if you will watch this video in 1080p at 60fps, you will get to know the actual smoothness of the smartphone. So yeah, it's really smooth and nice and fluid. Then the second thing which I like about this is there are subtle vibrations everywhere in the UI. So while you open the recent app, you will get a nice little vibration which feels very premium. So that is one thing. So yeah, this is one thing you need to know. And then we have the of course the factor that is Geekbench score. I know a lot of you guys actually watch my videos just for the score. So in today's video, I'm gonna do the live example of the Geekbench score. So let's just close all the apps, tap on score and yeah it's running so before that let's just talk about the overall device and yeah this device is still a tank i mean even in 2022 after a lot of heartbreak issues this device is still looks performs feels really good and in case you guys haven't seen it yet i have applied a very nice uh, you know ferrari skin in the poco x3 pro so look at that this looks even better what do you guys think tell me in the comments below there's a bit of you know uh, I think uh, yeah the screen the skin got destroyed from the corner and here because I dropped it one once but overall the skin looks great the display is also very nice but because of this NT reflective screen guard which I have applied the display isn't looking that bright but to be honest believe me it's very bright and colorful in this room especially it looks really awesome and yeah these quick tiles are just perfectly rounded no problems in that and we also have a new SS that is CPU info now this is not present in the previous builds but this is present in this and this basically shows you all the bunch of CPU infos here and you guys can see the temperature is like 47 degrees Celsius this is basically the temperature of the CPU so not the I mean the smartphone's battery so don't worry about that but overall the smartphone is great I mean it's just awesome the cameras are a little average not the best to be honest the skin looks awesome the design is also really good but the fact that it just heartbreak problem is a lot of is like a big thing and then we have this you know volume rockers and here if you will tap let me show you one thing unique you tap here and look at that this is a different ui compared to that which is present in the pixel roams because in the stock pixel experience you, do, you don't get these types of ui you get like uh, yeah i mean this is the bar and then you get a normal slider this is a lot more rounded it looks like miui type of slider but yeah it, it does look good to be honest what do you guys think tell me in the comments below and you don't get any vibration while swiping here and there so there's no vibration present but overall i think the two scores will actually give us the exact idea about the performance and now here let's just look at the extra toggles we have and here one thing I wanted to show you that is we also get a toggle of recording the voice so that is one thing unique because normally custom rooms don't have this voice recorder toggle and then we also have one more toggle and that is I mean yeah this is switch yeah switch data carrier and we also have the live display these types of toggles are not present in every custom room and I think it won't work also you know why because this doesn't have the super amulet display which a lot of smartphones does does have so yeah because of that it doesn't have that and yeah normally we have alarm we have airplane mode do not disturb bluetooth headlight yeah yeah screen recorder and screen recorder is of pretty decent quality let me just try to show you how does it work so if i go here tap on uh, wait tap on screen recorder you guys can see it will show a lot of options so this is very good for those who wanted to record gameplay of like bgmi and other stuff so that is really awesome so you can actually record a lot of stuff and right now one thing i can tell you while doing this benchmark the smartphone from this area is heating a bit now as i told you the poco x3 pro's heat management is the biggest issue and that is actually the issue which is faced by a lot of people so if you have this issue make sure to tell me in the comments below but yeah heating is there for sure hundred percent and yeah the scores are about to like just come and i'm very excited let's see the scores in this device right now so in three, two, one, boom, there you go. And yeah, this, this multi-core is very average, not that great. 763 is, I think, yeah, 
respectable because yeah this is the 779 dex 3 pro and this one got a little less but this is very average 228 is basically of uh, like a, sna a smartphone of snapdragon double five and even less than that so yeah this is average but normally it's not a big deal then scrolling in youtube is very smooth and that is one thing which i just love i mean even in oxygen 12 port of the x3 pro the scrolling in youtube is not smooth it's not this smooth like this is literally amazing man this is so smooth i just love it so yeah that wraps up my review what do you guys think about the pixel plus ui running in the poco x3 pro excellent call reception no problems there we have a lot of customizations we have the moment customizations you can do a lot of things basically like use custom colors and whatnot basically you will love it so that's it what do you guys think tell me in the comments below i will catch you in the next one make sure you like subscribe and peace out